stranded on a boat with a teammate. It'd be the biggest, so they can eat them. <laughs> oh, first duck on a boat, and there's nothing. I'm eating them. I don't get it. Nah, um... I reckon Governor. He's pretty smart. He's switched on. He knows what to do. He's spent a bit of time on the boat. He doesn't mind fishing. Uh, Bunger or Gov. Cause they're pretty good fishermen. So, either one of them. And Bunger usually takes heaps of packages of chips. So, always have some food. I'd take Jeremy McGovern. Bunger would look after me. He's like a dad in terms of his, he has so much life skill. He could do anything. Bunger probably purely based on the fact that he can fish. And he can swim too. Like you're not going to take a strike one out there and you're like, it's all right, mate, I'm going to kick the boat while you're just sitting there. Like, help me out. So probably Bunger. <laughs> bunger. Well, just survival skills. He must have them. Maybe Bunger. Experienced campaigner. Cool-headed. Knows how to fish. And he's got plenty of manpower. I have to be Bunger, I think. He'd, you know, that caveman top sort of operator. He'd be very valuable in terms of getting food and drink and shelter and all that kind of stuff. I'd, I'd probably go Bung. I feel like we could get along the whole time. I feel like he's going to contribute. Harry Edwards, just good quality. Jack Petricelli, because he doesn't require to eat much food, so I'll stay with him. That's what we like. We've got a lot in common, but then we don't also. So it's like, we kind of can bounce off each other, but then we can like hate each other. And then we can like hug each other all at once. Wouldn't like to be stranded with many of them, to be honest. Maybe like Cripper or Duggo, pretty good out in nature. They'll probably be able to catch something with their bare hands, so I wouldn't have to do much. It'd need to be someone pretty handy. Someone that wouldn't drive you insane. Probably Cripper. He's pretty quiet, but also knows what's going on. Jim Cripps. Loves spear fishing, know what species. So I'll definitely have him on the boat with me. Well, I'm gonna assume we're not surviving. There's not many of the boys that we, yeah, we're not gonna last, so it's all about having a good time while you can. And I'll take Josh Rotham. Good gags, light-hearted, yeah, it'll be fun. Probably Ruffy, yeah. I've been stranded one out with him since we were 15, so I'm pretty used to it. <laughs> Tommy Brass, because he'd probably be smart enough to keep us alive. I would like to be a Tom Brass. Fairly resourceful, quite clever. Tom Brass, complex thinker. I would assume he knows his way around a boat, whereas I wouldn't. I'd probably pick Ruben. I feel like he'd have good survival techniques, and he's also funny, like there's nothing worse around a boat with a non-funny person. He's a smart man. Dom Sheed, fucking he would think of a plan and get us out of there. Probably Noah Long, just really rate his value, and I think if I'm stuck in a boat with anyone, I mean, he doesn't weigh a lot, so I don't think he'd sink the boat or anything. He's good at cooking too, so like, if we ever come across any, like, fish or anything in the ocean, there's a few in there, <laughs> yeah, he'd be good at that.